Hello everybody, welcome back to Super Tech Services. This is a video for our customers on how to install the BizHub C754E driver. So first thing you want to do is just go into google.com and once you're there just go ahead and type in KMBS drivers. Just type that in Google and press enter. Once you've done that you're going to see the second option there that says self-help product support. Go ahead and click on that link there. Once you've done that, on the left hand side you're going to type in C754E into the quick search box. C754 with an E. Now that you've done that, go ahead and click the Drivers tab. After you click on the Drivers tab, just go ahead and find your version of software. I'm on Mac OS Ventura and if your software uh, is not on the list say it's one newer like 14.0 you can still use the 13.0 driver that's perfectly fine once you've done that just go ahead and find the one that says c754e letter.zip go ahead and click on that link and then download that file once that file is downloaded just go ahead and open it and just go ahead and double click the file there hit continue and follow all the prompts through just continue continue and then agree and then install then you put your password in and just like that the driver has been installed so next up what we're going to do is go ahead and add the printer with the driver so you're going to want to go to the Apple menu and then go down to printers and scanners and then click on add printer and then you're going to select this middle option here for IP address right where that globe is the middle option there for IP and then you're going to want to type in the IP address of the copier this could be found on the copier as well then you're going to select LPD you can also select AirPrint as well up top but we're going to stick with LPD on this video that's fine and after you're done you can just go ahead and name the copier whatever you would like and then under generic postscript this little tab here you're gonna go and click on select software and then type in C754E and the driver should be uh, populate there make sure it's the correct one and then go ahead and click add then under finisher you're gonna want to select FS534 that's the model finisher that we use and if you have a black and white machine you may have a punch kit but if this is a color machine you probably won't have a punch kit so don't worry about uh, the punch kit so you can just leave that on no none now the printer is installed and what we're going to do is just go ahead and print a test page don't worry about the errors that any errors that pop up just make sure that the test page prints and you'll know because it will disappear out of your print dialog box like it does like here and that was how to install the bizhub c754e drivers for mac thanks for watching